Hi, I'm Jack Schramm, the head bartender at Pernod Ricard. I'm here to show you how to make better drinks. I'd like to introduce you to a device that's made my life so much easier behind the bar and make my bar more sustainable. It's called the Spinzol. It's a culinary centrifuge developed by a company called Booker & Dax in New York City. The Spinzol is an excellent tool for techniques like clarification. Because it spins so fast, all of the solid particles of a juice like lemon, lime, watermelon, essentially any juice that you put into it, will be pressed to the inside of the rotor, leaving a completely clear product behind. This juice on its own is already more shelf stable than a fresh squeezed juice. But if you add sugar, creating a, a clear cordial, at that point you have a product that's infinitely shelf stable and value added. This is great for home or bar use. You can take a product like any spirit and a dried fruit or even a fresh fruit or vegetable, blend them together and then spin all the solid particles out, creating a ready to drink cocktail that you can serve to your guests or your friends or family that will make them so happy because it tastes so good. Aside from simply making things more delicious, the Spinzol will make your bar or home more sustainable. Today I'm going to demonstrate a technique that's colloquially referred to in, in many modern bars as a justino, a process of blending a dried fruit into a spirit. Today we're going to use dried mangoes and Del Maguey chichicapa, blending them together, then spinning them into a centrifuge to create a ready-to-drink cocktail. These flavors pair beautifully together. Chichicapa is a, is a, is a lower elevation espadine variety of mezcal that has this rich, salty minerality that pairs beautifully with mangoes. I'll take you through the process now. 12 ounces, 12 and a half ounces, half a bottle. It's a 25 ounce bottle. 12 and a half ounces of mezcal go into your blender pitcher. To that, you're going to add 75 grams of dried mangoes. Now a product that you may not be familiar with, it's called pectinase. This is a product that breaks down the pectins that hold fruits and vegetables together in their existing form. It allows us to extract flavor and also helps remove the solids once we start spinning it in the centrifuge. Per liter of product, you're gonna to wanna to add four milliliters of pectinase. So in this situation, when I'm starting with 375 milliliters of mezcal, I'm gonna add two milliliters of pectinase to also account for the, the weight and volume of the mangoes that I've added. This can be done in a micro pipette, but if you don't have one, or the, the expense is too great, just grab a graduated cylinder. Two mils goes in. Now we'll blend. You want to take it to a place where the mango is fully emulsified into the mezcal. You don't want to see lots of little bits. You want to actually get it fully incorporated. The pectinase will do the job of removing it later. At this point, it's ready to go in the Spinzol. Now the Spinzol is a great tool because you can run it in two modes, either batch, which I'm going to demonstrate today, or continuous. It has a peristaltic pump on the back, allowing you to feed fresh product into the rotor throughout the process, rather than only doing up to 500 milliliters at a time. I've spun liter after liter of fresh lime juice, fresh grapefruit juice, and in just a few hours, I've had enough clarified product to feed a 200 person event. It's a great tool. Today we're just making the one batch, so I'm gonna spin it in batch mode right here just in the rotor. The lid goes back on, locks into place, and we're ready to spin.
close. It's ready. It's just gonna take another moment to, to slow down. I'm so excited to taste this. I love this product. Mango and mezcal, especially Faustino's Chichicapa expression of Espadine is so beautiful together. Be prepared for a brilliant orange. Also fun, while most of the flavor has been stripped out into the, the, the liquid itself, in the interior of that rotor, there's that puck, this mango mezcal flavored, essentially like spread that exists on the inside of the rotor. This is great for, for culinary applications, for things like adding to an icing on a cake. Not necessarily delicious to drink, but there are so many applications for, for every part of the product that you put into a Spinzol. Smells beautiful and just pour it over ice and allow it to dilute a little bit. It becomes an incredible cocktail. A great gift because you're giving someone something that's ready to drink. It's not a chore, it's actually a gift. Nobody wants a, a shaking tin set for Christmas. They want booze they can drink right now. If you have any questions about the spins all, about sustainability, about anything, but mostly about this, feel free to reach out in the comments below. If there's one thing I love talking about, it's a spins off. Until next time. This has been Better Drinks.